marriage is abused because many people don't know the reason for marriage many people think that the reason for marriage is to take care of me error the reason why i'm married to my wife is not for her to take care of me that is secondary it's not for me to take care of her that's secondary that's why you will notice when the bible talks about marriage there's somebody that he always puts into the marriage love your wife as christ loves the church submit to your husband as unto the lord there's always that lord part that means there's this figure that is a head in the marriage is the one that institutes the marriage so the purpose of marriage is not really for two of you to take care of each other remember marriage came out of this following world it is not good that a man should be alone marriage started as a mechanism for help help for what not help the man help the man to do what help the man to rub his back his back needs rubbing, so let me make an help me to rub his back. No, help him to fulfill a particular assignment. So marriage came out of a need for an assistant in an assignment. I will make him an help me suitable for him to fulfill. Because before the woman came, God says the man should tend the garden. Before the woman came, the man had an assignment, tend the garden. In fact, the man was so busy doing that assignment that he named everything. It's an assignment. Now, you ask in modern days, I tell everybody who is married here, your first assignment is your children. The Bible puts it this way. He said, if he doesn't rule his house well, he should not come to the church and start ruling them. Because he has failed in his first assignment. I have ministry. You're a liar. First do that, your first assignment is God's face. Your first assignment is your children. It's to bring them properly in the way of the Lord.